A little boy is recovering tonight, the innocent victim of a drive-by shooting in Brockton. The bullet only grazed the three-year-old, and fortunately, he'll be okay. The gunshots rang out around 1 o'clock this afternoon. WBZ Shantae Lands is in Brockton with the details. Ken and Katie Brockton police are now looking for the shooter. The boy is at home resting. I spoke with his grandmother, who says she's thankful that this didn't turn out much worse. I'm sitting on Fuller Street, sitting on the picnic table, enjoying myself with a friend of mine. And the next thing I know, pop, pop, pop. There's like six rounds go off. Bullet holes riddle this Bartlett Street home. A three-year-old boy was shot while inside. One, two, four, five, Street. Was been grazed by a ricochet bullet. To the leg with minor bleeding. And I just don't think it's right that, I mean, especially in the middle of the day on a Saturday. Witnesses say the shooting happened outside. Um, I just saw a kid running right, right past behind the fence where we were sitting. He ran right through the fence, and I knew either he was running from, either he was scared or whatever. The child's family says he doesn't live at the house but was visiting relatives. A mailman also nearby was not hit, but his truck what? It's just a shame being a resident and have to go through all this. Some neighbors are now looking to move. It's a shame, you know, Brockton's, you know, trying to, we're trying to clean the city up, things are going good, and then uh, this happens. It's just discouraging, you know, being a resident. My, you know, my wife's Filipino and she doesn't even want to live here anymore. She says there's more gunshots here than there were in the Philippines. And so far, no arrests. If you have any information, you're asked to contact police. In Brockton, Shante Lands, WBZ News.